Mead Alistair is going to be taking the first contact. Spots one, falls on back, but they are chasing him down. He gets stuck on the frame as he jumps on through. Hardtail gets an opener for free, and they are wrapping fast. Sicko is here, gets one mm. back, and a second. The bomb delivered. Vexite's here as well, and, well, now it's tricky for these remaining players. Surprised to see them run into Temple after getting the Akon kill, but I guess the smoke thwarted the original plan. Nice duelies tap, and it's going to be Neckers who's stuck behind enemy lines, but with no bomb. And Greyhound will surely be waiting for this eventuality. Yeah, it's really unfortunate they didn't make a different play based off the kill that they got. But uh, yeah, I mean, they obviously tried to follow through with their original plan, and it didn't work out. Shredded. You like the Julies twist? I see I see every pistol around nowadays. You can't go a pistol around without the Julies. No, the Julies are, are really good. Maybe too right, good. That's just the orb holding it down. Sevi, oh, he had to turn because flashes came through, but they were on both it's sides, and Liaz, he chews them up. MP9 at that range. Does strike true. Nekez now trying to make his way back. Alistair is tucked in here with his MP9. It's a good angle. Nekez going to walk Ooh. around. Alistair able to adjust just about. And because there is not in a position to trade, Vexite pushing down mid is also potentially going to catch the timing. Oh, it eludes him. Hardzow comes around. That is so unfortunate. Because they are sitting yeah, all the way back nice. in the canals. And yeah, it's perfect. Alistair just wants to get out. Denied. And Liaz is forced to save an MP9. I think he'll try to go and find the AK. I think he'll run through the arch here. And Oh, never mind. Yeah, it's a rough one to only save the MP9. I mean, it's not the weapon you definitely want to save. I don't think Inns wants the MP9. Alistair going mid with that AWP. Zevi takes his back to where we saw before. Post up looking at Dark. Oh, Alistair close. Oh. Because there is blinded, but it doesn't matter. Sam's on through in a second as well. Middle prize wide open. Actually swapping over to the AWP. I mean, he can just hold down this angle, right? I wonder if that yeah, smoke's on purpose, right? Like, that's quite a deep smoke. That's a significant gap. He jumped straight I mean, up. He knew right where he was looking. Yeah, exactly. He, he understood the path that he wanted to take already. So, yeah, I think it was by design. Nice catch. Glocks, but this ain't Glocks. Uh, he eats the flash. Shuni, Nekev. Oh, he's going to yeah. clear him out. And yeah, that's that's it done. Sight taken. Bob could be planted. Lee has an ends nowhere nearby. At least that AWP can be recovered in mid. That's a small thing that they can take on through. I don't think we'll see Pain going hunting either with their money as yeah. it is. Hit now onto A this time around. Liaz and Alistair are here. Alistair tucked on in next to the corner. And they're just going to swing on out. The bomb dropped in the open. Hardzow went for the peak. Everyone else has been hepped at bay by this utility. And the rotations are here. Skull strikes for one. Alistair is taken down, as is Vexite. The orb coming through. And again, it's just a great side take. There's no way for Greyhound to respond. I mean, that side just collapsed. I don't really, there's nothing to really analyze there. It seems like they were confident enough to swing with one one final flash and they were able to take down all three players. Uh, I thought it was a bit over for Payne once the bomb entry first. Behind said spot is going to be looking for a fight with the Desert Eagle. Swings on out for one. They haven't cleared him yet. Gets a second. Nekes trades him, but it's kept this round doable. Zevi gets one back. Alistair swings through with a USP and luckily Zevi is holding because it almost looked like he was going to win that one. I mean, they swapped off the... Oh, see ya. Yeah, yeah. And that's what they wanted, right? Yeah, they patient. Holding, waiting for a mistake to happen. They're going to regroup back outside A, but this double setup with one of the orbs for Greyhound, they are in the right place. Alistair, if he hits one, he sets up Liaz so Perfect. well. There it is. Gets the shot, can fall on back. Liaz is still tucked on in. Still got a line. I mean, they have a, a good setup here because Vexite will deny mid anyway. Ooh, That's unfortunate. Now he's under pressure. Yeah, now he's alone, really alone. Mid's gone down as well. Oh, They're both very the awkward. Smoke. You hear the players in the smoke. It. They're just jumping around. What? They know he's there, surely. I, no, I, I, don't, I don't think they'll have any idea. Yeah. They're waiting for because they're already oh! clear. Alistair, what, what a play. shot that is. A 3v2 now, and he knows the second was here. Heard them making noise, oh, nice. and he strikes again. Just hard down now, picks up the AWP from his teammate. And they are being very passive here for Greyhound. Hardzow walks up close. Mm. A no-scope angle, if I ever saw one, peeking around it. But Siko has fallen back. A bit more passive, Ooh. misses the shot. Hardzow gets the opportunity. And now they're both from the same angle, but it's Alistair completing his quadra. Is he going to clear it, though? Oh, no. Easy shot. And they're walking out mid as well. This is so scary. They're going to see his barrel first. They know what's coming. And he couldn't hit the flick in time. Still the as with a lineup potentially. But Hardzow trades. And there's no one left on A. The bomb is actually nowhere near oh, any boy. of these players. Nekes has to go all the... 
We'll see oh, if that happens. Oh, he's got to turn. Oh, oh I knew my it. God. Oh, <laughs> could not have gone worse. Fudge, because he knows if they come here and get the bomb, it has to be towards oh, B. Sicko strikes another. This round is done. Hardtower can't do anything. Got to make sure you take the bomb with you. That's yep. a key part of Counter-Strike. Harry is molding right now. That's the guy who, who throws the bomb the second he gets in spawn. Oh dear, it's beautiful for Sicko. Second door, and there's the Sicko here as well on the obelisk. Misses the first shot, faded out by the movement. In's cleared as well. Vexite wow. tucked, Sicko fell. It's all now no onto way. the young gun, oh. and he's cleared, but Vexite still finds the kill. What? One gun out for another. Zevi dropped with the bomb. And now the time is dwindling quickly. There's a kit on Liaz, but both players tucked in at the back. They've got the info, and Hardtail's got the shot. Skulls to trade. Liaz falls, and Pain Gaming. He's falling on back. There's a flash peek at B as well. Sicko doesn't realize they're just on the ledge. He wow. recovers that spray very well. Two kills from this guy already in the round. And yeah, is this too far? No, I think this off angle is great. Is he going to get the oh. for sure? Yeah. I don't think he'll expect the player in T spawn. Three will do. Three for one. That's a yeah. discount now deal. Three, two, and they have the B bomb side. So maybe his teammate overstayed. And now Payne at full control. Smoke down in Temple. Going to drop across one as well to get that plant on the middle of the site. Greyhound have almost no utility. One flashbang to get them in. Liaz is crawling into an orbs angle as well. Zevi's going to take a safer post point. He's also got a molly for this. This can get very hairy with no kit. That smoke going to be fading soon. So another molly comes on through. Zevi actually repositioned so he can support his teammate holding Liaz's position. Skull oh. strikes first. Oh, gets them both. Liaz comes on no through. Kit. They know where Skulls is. Has to find it fast though because of that kit. Oh. And Skulls is there. Takes four in the round. Sharp yeah, as you like it. Flash out on B to start, and it's a dink, but no more. Because Zera lives, they line up, but it's not enough for Inns to take anything other than one, and they're just going to go activate quick on B, taking uh, Dark really quickly. Vexai's going to edge his way behind the pillar in time, and Alastair does have long, but this is still a two on four. Well, that smoke towards Dark has slowed it down, and Alastair's actually going to throw it out main as well. That nade ah, is really damaging. So and Hardzow's just taking him down, so Vexai's the only one here. Liaz is still in mid, and this is impossible. Four players about to be storming on him, and he doesn't even get a chance to fight one. Good luck. <laughs> Save. Oh, dear. Dude, Teddy's he's so quick. Something to look at, but I, I really don't think they're as much as he. Well, the hit's coming through towards A. Skulls opens it up, taking down Vexite. Alistair's on a fast flank, but Big Azir is holding for this. And there's a fight on site. Liaz takes a little bit of damage, and Big Azir are ready for it. Even spotting out Sicko does go down. That bomb is going to be planted just below Inns, but he can't do anything to deny it. Nekaz is also now holding for Sicko, so it's just Liaz and Inns to get it done. Zevi with a fast adjustment leaves it all onto the shoulders of Liaz, tucked in towards the smoke. Waiting for it to fade, waiting with desperation, but it's 11 for Pain, looking dominant here on Anubis. It's a lot of pressure now onto Skulls. The first contact coming on through. The rotations are fast. That flashbang is good. Skulls gets one. Zevi as well with the dual Berettas gets two. And now suddenly this one's falling apart. He's looking for more. So many bullets in the chamber. Sicko's actually dropped his gun to find another run out of his bullets. He's going to run out of time. That's yeah, rough. I think that was a must-needed piss okay. around win for, for Greyhound. And Leah's just going to be lurking on through, taking this contact. Oh, and it has panicking. caused some movement. Vexite gets rewarded with a kill. Alistair walking on through. Oh, Nekhead no. catches so him unlucky. and it baits out Hardzow for a kill. Bomb in the Need open. It. Sicko trying to find something bad, but Nekhead swings on through. Finally in. Delivers oh. with two. And that might be enough. The bomb now can go down. A fast flank, though. Leah's holding for it. Catches him. All now onto Big Uzira coming on through from CT. A kit in front of him to collect, but two players that he needs to find. He's got one isolated, but Inns is holding rock oh, solid. Yeah. I mean, look at the utility on the T side, and look at the utility on the T side. They've done a great job at draining out the, the nade usage from Pain. This push and canals. Oh, Nekes is here oh. with a teammate. Oh, Alistair oh, spotted caught. the bomb goes down. A lot of T's here to trade, but Nekes is staying behind the pillar. Inns found bigger zero, though. Yeah, the that was open in mid. They, they know they killed all the B players. Perfect, they can keep in, post it up, holding the connector rotation. Oh, Skulls just jumps on into his crosshair. And Zevi's got the AWP, and he can't do anything with it. Can maybe hope for a catch somebody towards dark, but not going to be the case. I'm believing now. You're believing? I'm That's believing the gun now. round. That got the gun you on round. the board. Mm. 
Picking on through, taking the ground, no, lost by his teammate. This no, is a very smart it. push. Yeah. yeah, exactly. I mean, there's a teammate behind him, but they also had info in this area originally. Oh, but it's, oh, oh it's ugly. that's unfortunate. unfortunate. He made the right play, though. Yeah. If he doesn't get spotted there, he might just win the round. The bomb's outside B, not even considering it. Now Hardzai wants to have his chance at it. Why not? A third guy pushing mid? Nah, that wouldn't happen. Yeah, exactly. I mean, that's how Counter-Strike is. Why would you expect a third one to be here? But he might get caught the exact same way as his teammate yeah. did. Oh, he's running. Oh, he is it. That's yeah. lovely. And now he can just reset as well. Play a retake round. They've actually got some util. He picked up the kit in middle at the same time. Greyhound have a lot to throw at this, though. That was not the smoke. This just dribbled oh. through. It doesn't cry to any cover at all, but still the bomb gets across. Incendiary and the HE to follow. We'll do a little bit of damage on the Vexite. Oh, oh hard out. The lineup catches Vexite. Sicko now out towards main, worried about a Rumpel. route, but it's not coming. Hey, she's good. Alistair around. Obelisk strikes. Skulls fall. Spots another. Oh. The quick scope doesn't connect, but now he knows where both of them are. Sicko can support. Alistair just waiting around the Obelisk. Scopes on in, looking for the fight. Not quite there, but Sicko is. And it's all now on the hard down. Oh, wow. And Alistair close. Yeah. Smoke before they go. 30 seconds, and they're lining up flashes. Usually you're not wanting to smoke this because now they can be on the right or left. Oh, straight And now contact. they're feeling a lot of pressure. Hadza misses, but Big Zera does not. Inz gets one back though, and so does Nick has falling. Hadza doesn't even get to fire off his orb. Liaz clears him. With a few seconds left, that bomb can be planted, and Zevi with an orb cannot retake. Oh, he's given an opportunity. Liaz falls. Now we but still. We see one of these eight plays. It's been a while for Greyhound. They're creeping through oh, smokes. Yeah. They just walk through that smoke. And the timing of the flash is great, but Liaz just hits a shot blind. I think because there might have been spotted yeah, as well, yeah. crossing on up, and now he's getting burnt oh, on out. Vexite gets that one. Zevi's here, has to be the hero for them. Misses the first shot, gets nice. the second. The no swing, no trade. Zevi's now repositioned uh -oh. on the side. They're jiggling him. He's getting these fights one by one, and it's even things back up three apiece. I'll give you that much, and it's very rare in the 42nd mark that they run back through T-Spawn. It's oh, going to be here quick, though. Look, yeah. Alistair's Sorry. not ready for it. Caught off guard. In the only one oh, remaining I gets that first, looking for more. He doesn't one expect a double temple. flank, though. Yeah, the second one in dark could be oh. his demise. Repositions, tucking in towards Goblin, tucked on in, hidden, can't be spotted. Nice. But Zevi just walks on oh, through and finally pain break the street. He's want to create enough pressure for it, for Inza to slip the gap here. Oh, check this. Oh, the timing. Zevi looking. Not oh. gonna catch him. Inz has walked on through because there oh are no comes through in clutch. Worst case scenario. Zevi strikes. Sicko gets one no. back, but he's been brought down low. Swaps to the AK. No time oh. for him to do oh. anything. Alistair going for the classic peak. Ooh, oh, Zevi. This is what I'm oh, about. they're both really here. Yeah. Different angles. Alistair gets one back. Bigazera though catches in through the smoke. That was in mid. Nice so model. finally, Bigazera comes out ahead there. They were going to go. They were just going to hit it on A, but that molly has stopped everything, and it's even going to get re-smoked. Greyhound don't care about yeah, the Alistair doesn't though. care. Yeah, Specifically, they, Alistair yeah. doesn't care about any utility. He's just been walking through to find bombs. They won't commit, though. They're going to go back to fight Dark, which has already just been re-smoked as well. However, that's, if anything, helpful to Greyhound. They get to walk up with a guarantee of no info. They seem so uncertain about what they want to do, though, well, back and forth. Yeah, I mean, Payne doesn't have any smokes anymore, so that connector area will be free eventually, and I mean, he has to leave at some point. I think Skull's in a really good position to go one for one, 100%. That's enough if he can do it. Sitting on top of the bench. They're definitely oh, free fire Oh, tagged by shoulder. Alistair. Now it's a three on three. Big as there, drops down into the site. Alistair's holding heaven. Not accounted for yet, and they're keeping it patient. Utility comes on through now. Alistair waiting for his teammates to come on through. Big Azera has to come up big. Both rotations coming through CT. Currently blocked off. Big Azera tucks on through, swings oh, on out. And Alistair finds hard out as well. All now Perfect onto Deckers, and there's Sicko. Greyhound have to waste another 15, and they don't know that four still stand. This could get hairy, guys. I mean, they have two smokes still at B, which is... Ooh, ooh, what? That helps things a lot. A spam through the smoke takes Vexite out. Zevi's looking to try and pluck one as well. Resmoke in. Yeah, they're doing it well. Run they still have one smoke yeah. at B. That smoke's going to be there. You can resmoke connector basically for the rest of the, the round. Three players in mid. They're just going to push on through. Oh, God. It's going to happen, guys. Oh, don't say it. 
Not like this. Come on, Greyhound. Be ready for this it. Oh, no. Zevi struck another. Oh, Alistair yeah. ends in sicko. Have to do it all. Skulls is oh, through. Yeah, this Chases the Alistair over. down. Ends has found two on the side, but he has to find three more. He's the A is required, and he's going towards A. Goes silent on that cross bit, but I still think Bigger Zero is aware. Making it fast all the way over. Might even catch the timing here. Oh, no. There's nothing to do. He heard him. Now he has to take the one-on-one -on -one duel. He's got six bullets in his gun, guys. He hasn't even got the reload off. This needs to be a precise headshot to start the 1v5. Oh, oh, he's gone. Pain, oh, do it, folks. Oh, oh, That's oh, it. Oh, Playoffs oh, for Pain. Oh, they eliminate, or not eliminate, they push Greyhound rather down to that last chance bracket. Oh,